the reason I think he's going to get in the Hall of Fame is the two MVPs in in the Super Bowl. So no matter what do he does at the end of his career, it's not going to erase those accomplishments. And I, I, I do think, especially in New York, things look better as time goes on, right? We look back at Phil Sims, I think, more fondly than we did when Phil was here. Because Phil, they, they used to, the fans used to chant Phyllis. They had a lot of problems with Phil Sims. And then now you tw now 20 years removed from the last time he played almost, it, and we wax poetic about him. I think 10, 15 years from now, we'll look back at the Eli Manning era and those Super Bowls and are going to shine through. Now listen, nobody remembers Willie Mays with the Mets. That didn't hurt, right? And those that do, that's their issue. Yeah. And, you know, it nobody, didn't hurt his Hall of Fame It, it didn't hurt. You know, Jordan playing in Washington didn't, didn't affect his greatness. People just kind of forgot about it. I think they'll remember the Super Bowls. They'll remember the playoffs. I don't think he's a first ballot guy. He might have to wait a little while it, rather than if he had won another Super Bowl or played much better. But I think he'll still eventually get in. You can't move. I love those people. Uh, take out those two Super Bowls. You, you can't you take can't, them out. Yeah, how do you do that? They're, they're, they're two giant but, skyscrapers. But one thing, and I've said this before, if he never went to those Super Bowls and had the exact same numbers, he would not be a Hall of Famer, in my opinion. Maybe Philip Rivers. Is Philip Rivers going He's to the Philip, Hall of Fame? No, I don't think he is. Unless maybe he gets the Super Bowl in the next couple of years. Philip Rivers' numbers are just as good as Eli's. Romo, too. Yeah, take a look but at, they're not going to the Hall of Fame. Look, take a look at Romo's regular season. Right. So, I mean, you can't take out a Super Bowls, but if you could play God and took out those Super Bowls, even if he went to the Super Bowls and had the wins in Green Bay, but they lost both times to the Patriots, I don't think he's a Hall of Famer. I no, just don't. No, it does help. Granted, they pass a lot more back in the day, but if you look at the top 10 statistics, he's there because right. he compiled a lot. He played for a long time. And also never missing a game to injury. That, that's still something special. But you're right. Those are two immovable objects, oh, the Super Bowls. Well, they're unbelievable. 1-800-919-3776. It, it, it separates his, his career from, from very good he's, to great. He's as unique an athlete as I think in sports. I don't know if you can come up with another player in professional sports like Eli, where everybody's sure he's going to the Hall of Fame, but it's kind of based on just the two, two games. Seasons. Can, yeah. can you think of a baseball player like no. that? Can you, no. you know, can I think of a hockey player? Or, Peter, can you think of a basketball player that cemented himself in history, but overall you kind of feel not so sure? Not so I don't sure. Know, Eli's unique in that sense. Yeah. It's really unique. I've,